Hello one and all, this is Wolfstar Gaming, I am Anton Savetin, and welcome back to another episode of Persona 5 Royal. Alright, so our expulsion is coming up, the board meeting is just, what was it, the next day? Um, I know last video I ended up, ended off uh, pondering whether or not to study, but then I just remembered that uh, Morgana keeps mentioning to me look, uh, if I bring up the log, will it? No. Okay. So my log does not carry over uh, to So my log, uh, my log doesn't carry over to so the, meaning of this? the next time I play the game, I guess. So Morgana keeps talking about washing the this sooty armor I have. Where do I have to go for that? Uh. Especially bathed old person. Phew, today's bath was simply amazing as usual. Every Sunday feels like heaven when the medicinal bath permeates into my bone. Now then, should I head home or drop by the bar first? I, uh, th that's your decision, buddy. Bathhouse. Oh, here we go. Oh, the close inside is spinning over and over and over and over and over and over. <laughs> I'm starting to get dizzy. I think this thing might be dangerous. <laughs> For a cat, yeah, a dryer would be dangerous. Okay, washing machine. I can now quick travel to the laundromat. Okay. Hey, don't you have the sooty armor? How about washing it now? Okay, using the laundromat. I need a tutorial for this? It will cause time to pass. Okay. Uh, be able to wash sooty armor for 400 yen. Okay. Doing so will clean it and reveal its true potential. Its true potential, huh? But the four items can be washed in a cycle. The item you receive is up to chance. Up to chance. Okay. Be sure to visit the laundromat when you have sooty armor. Oh. Just the sooty armor. Okay. And I have a few of them. Uh. Okay. So, let's... Say for cats, women's equipment, unisex, men's. Well, let's let's do the one for on the sooty ladies' armor. You can fit three more items. What do you want to do? Uh, actually, yeah. Let's uh, let's go ahead and do that then. So, do the sooty heavy armor. The uh, one for Morgana. I only had one of those. Okay. And si uh, since there's two guys, I'll do uh, two sooty heavy armors. Nothing else is going to fit in there. Want to run the washing machine now? Yes, run the wash. All right. I'm glad I have enough, uh, yeah. Hey, hey. This thing is shaking a lot. <laughs> that, it is jiggling uh, a little bit, yes. Um, washing, uh, washing machine shouldn't really be doing that. How old are the, uh, how old are these washing machines? 
they look like they are really old. Well, I hope this will wash clean. Oh. Riveting start to this episode, isn't it? <laughs> Doing my laundry. It's funny, I actually do my own laundry over the weekend, and I, I you know, every weekend because, you know, because of work. But, anyway. Oh, it looks like it's done. And... Ooh. <laughs> Ooh, this is much cleaner than I expected. Oh, they actually changed. The sooty armors, when cleaned, you get new, actually new items. Angel's cape, Duke's coat, and old cat collar. All right. Let's head back. Haley, let's head home. Okay. I only remembered to do that. <sighs> this is no good. And Mondays are such a drag. Why couldn't they give us today off too? We have the rest of the week starting the the rest of the week off starting tomorrow. Yeah, it's ridiculous. Speaking of, what's up with that calling card? The one sent to Kamashita. Didn't it say something about stealing his disordered desires or something weird like that? Yeah, it's nothing like that. I'm sure it's just a prank. No one's taking it seriously. Uh, they just don't know. <laughs> I'll have to check out uh, these armors when What's I get the chance. The morning assembly. I bet it's about that girl that jumped the other day. I don't think so. I think it's about Kamashita. They don't have to tell us not to commit suicide. Well, it, it doesn't hurt for a. Friendly reminder of how suicide can affect people. There was that weird calling card too, so I guess the teachers are freaking out. We're there is also the that. This got canceled though. I feel like I'm gonna faint if this takes forever. <sighs> On? You doing okay? Let's begin this school-wide morning assembly. As you all know, a tragic event took place the other day. Thankfully, we have been informed that she has pulled through, but it will take time until she recovers. Okay, first it's about Shiho. Okay. But this also has to be about Kamashita, too. Everyone here has a bright future ahead. I implore that you rethink the importance of life and... Would that be Kamashita coming in to the gym? Mr. Kamashita, what's the I have been reborn. Reborn. Okay. He he looks utterly uh his not his like sprite, but his character model. He looks completely defeated. That is why I will confess everything to you all. Hmm. Okay, th this should be interesting. Huh? What's wrong with Mr. Komushita? What's this about? Confess? Did the volleyball team do something? I have repeatedly done things that were unbecoming of a teacher. Yes, you have. Things that no teacher should do to their students. 
verbally abusing students, physically abusing my team, and sexually harassing female students. I am the reason why Shiho Suzui tried to kill herself. Sexual harassment? What? Why would he oh, say that himself? Uh, he is the team? worst. Really? Physical abuse? I thought of the school as my own castle. There were even students that I sentenced to expulsion simply because I didn't like them. And that's absolutely no reason to expel them. It's not a good enough reason. I will, of course, rescind those. Good. As he should. I am truly sorry for putting innocent youths through such horrible acts. I mean, how long has he been doing this? I can only assume that he's been doing this since before he even came to Shujin Academy. I am an arrogant, shallow, and shameful person. No, I'm worse than that. I will take responsibility. I kill myself for it. Now, I, I don't wish death on anyone, even in a video game. He doesn't need to kill himself. He can just be, you know, like, rehabilitated. What? Did he just say that? Wait, kill himself? Mr. Kamoshida is, uh, not well. Mr. He, Kamoshida, please died. get off the stage for now. Everyone, return to your classes. <laughs> I... Don't run, you bastard! On. Shiho's still alive, even after all the things that made her want to die. You have no right to run from this! Yeah, uh, On is seeing... Uh, with him saying that he, he will kill himself, On is seeing that as a way of him running from his... From running away from what he's done. To, of course, not just Shiho, but to every student that's been involved with him. You're right. You're absolutely right. I should be punished under the law and atone for my crimes. Yes. I did horrible things to Takamaki-san as well. In return for giving Suzui-san a position on the team, I... I tried to force her into having relations. Disgusting. Ugh, for a position on the team? I feel so That's bad horrible. for Takamaki-san. So the rumors son. weren't true. As of today, I will resign from my position as an instructor and turn myself in. Someone, please call the police. The police? Is he for real? He's gonna get wow. arrested? This morning's assembly is over. Return to your classes immediately. Isn't this just like what that calling card said? Yeah. Does this mean the Phantom Thieves thing was for real? Was something done to Kamashita? Come on, there's no way you could steal someone's heart. Well, apparently... It... Apparently, you can. At least, in this game. In this world. 
But why else would he start saying things like he'll kill himself or turn himself in? Yeah. Maybe because it almost got leaked? Don't they go easier on you if you turn yourself in? I mean, it... It's better if you turn yourself in rather than, you know, the police having to, you know, arrest him themselves. I wonder what happened. Who knows? But man, Kamashita turned out to be one sick bastard. Hey, is this for real? He's turning himself in just like that? What's going to happen this to the bowling no ball? Team Marathi will show up this now. is gonna be a big Return to your classrooms at once! His heart really did change. Castle of Lust seeds. And his heart did change. It's like we made a difference. No one knows about it, though. Seems like it. But was this really for the best? Yes. We couldn't let him continue, you know, his downward spiral, spiral of the way he had been living his life. I think so, I don't know. But what Kamashita said. You mean the police stuff? Well, that's true. Huh? What the? Uh, hi, Mishima. Or now that we've finally learned his first name, his given name, uh, Yuta, I actually want to. I should actually start calling him that. I don't really like calling people by their last name, really. Even characters. Tsukamaki san, I'm sorry. Why is he huh? apologizing? We all knew, but we pretended we didn't. Oh? Takamaki-san, I had you all wrong. I'm sorry that I spread rumors about you. Okay, she said Ans family name correctly. Takamaki. Finally, finally someone in game said her family name correctly. I didn't know at all. Oh, Kamashita was forcefully pushing himself on you. It must have been so hard for you. I'm sure there's a ton of people who want to apologize to you. Oh, like, uh, uh, like all the rumors that have been going around about her? Yeah, that, that would be a, that, that would be a good step toward changing things. Not just for Kamashita, but also for On and, you know, it, just anyone involved, really. We're so sorry. No, it's okay. The same goes for me, too. Besides, that's all in the past now. Hey, you there! Return to class at once! Well, see you later then. I can't apologize enough for what I did to you. It's okay. Okay, buddy. I swear I'll make it up to you someday. I mean, how could he make it up? 
I mean, I could, I could see him potentially joining our group, joining, joining the Phantom Thieves and joining my party. I could see that happening, but at the same time, I, I don't know if he actually will. Looks like Kamoshida ain't the only one that had a change of heart. Yeah. Man, I'm glad for you. Looks like those weird rumors are gonna go away. Yeah. Now that Kamoshida confessed everything, you know, all the rumors about on should stop. My thing doesn't really matter. Really on? You don't really believe that, do you? I made Kamoshida apologize about Shiho. That's more than enough for me. I mean, if that's the way you feel... You should hurry and tell her about it, then. Yeah. I totally freaked out. He really did have a change of heart. He did. Boy, uh, that was pretty heavy. That was pretty heavy. Um... I mean, I, I do wonder from Kamashita's perspective, when, when he decided not to come to school, it's like, what, I really do wonder what was going through his mind once we uh, changed his uh, heart, took his medallion. Or not medallion, metal. Um, it's like fr from his perspective, I really want to know. And we were lucky his mind didn't get messed up either. <laughs> this was an A plus job. Yeah, fortunately, he didn't have the. Um, mental, uh, that mental, like, lockup or whatever, uh, however, uh, Morgana had described it to us. Fortunately, that didn't happen. So that's good. That's really good for our first foray into doing this. Does this mean that they won't have a mental shutdown even if their palace disappears? Mental shutdown, that's it. I see. So we need to persuade the shadow without killing it, and then send it back to its real self. Persuade the shadow without killing it, and send it back to its real self. Okay. Even though that when I fought Kam uh, Shadow Kamashita, I wound up not being able to steal the crown off the top of his head. But it, all the same, it worked out. Our targets won't undergo a cognitive collapse if we do that. So we can get him to confess with no bad stuff? Sounds like it. Hey, that works for me. Do you have to be so loud? A Ryuji's kind of a loud, uh, a loud person. It, it's just kind of part of his personality. <laughs> it's like, just kind of have to get used to it. Eh, don't worry about it. So, how'd it go? With Shiho, I mean. 
She's regained consciousness. That's good. For real? He loves to say that. <laughs> it was only for a little bit, but I got to talk to her. Okay, Aaron. I was able to tell her that Kamoshida admitted to what he did. Shiho, she... She told me she was sorry. Looks like she found out that I was flirting with Kamoshida for her sake. Yeah, to get him to back off uh, to get him to back off of uh, Shiho, right? So he, it's like since On and Shiho are best friends, On felt like she had to protect Shiho by having Kamashita uh, really have a relationship with on with her and she did that for the most part it seems but then a wrench was thrown in and she wound up still wound up getting hurt unfortunately but fortunately He's regained consciousness and he's okay now. And here I was, wanting to apologize to her. Well, you should still, you can still apologize. Kamoshida's at fault for all this. Yes. And, and really, he should be the one to apologize to Shiho. He should have apologized to every single student that he has physically abused and sexually harassed. He should like one by one, not as a group, but one by one, starting with Shiho and on. I know. Shiho's mom is thinking of transferring her to another school after she recovers. Oh. Huh. The whole sexual harassment and attempted suicide, people will label her after that. I... Possibly. Sounded like Shiho had the same idea, too. Hmm. Ah, it's gonna get lonely. But I think it's for the best. I'm sure it'll be hard if she stays here. But you and her can always stay friends. You can always look out for her. She's alive. You can see her anytime. Yeah. Pretty much what I just said. I need to change too. That aside, I was surprised you could hold yourself back against Kamoshida's shadow. Hmm. <laughs> it wasn't like that. I just wanted Kamoshida to apologize himself. You're so kind, Lady On. No matter how much of a shitbag he was, finishing him off would have left a bad aftertaste, huh? Huh? That's not it. I think revenge is better served if I make him repent. Realizing what he's done, he'll grovel for forgiveness the rest of his life, you know? I mean, he seemed to, like, really be, uh, torn up about it, 
kind of beat himself up a bit. I just believe there are fates worse than death. There can be, yes. Holy shit. Uh, anyways, that's all settled. But, you know, there was one more thing I was wondering about that castle. Why was Kamoshida the only one who had that metaverse thing? That metaverse thing? What, uh, what exactly are you talking about, Ryuji? I'm trying to think of what he's referring to. I could be forgetting something. It isn't necessarily limited to him. It's something anyone could have if their heart became warped from their desires. Right. Anyone. Wanna check it out? Not right now. We better lay low for a while. People are still gonna be talking about Kamushida. Then again, it's totally impossible for someone to find out what we did at his palace. Probably not entirely poss impossible. Yeah, about that, weird rumors about you guys are already going around. What kind of rumors? You wanna fill us in about that? Stuff like you got together and threatened Kamoshida with something close to physical violence. Okay. People aren't going to easily believe that phantom thieves really exist. Calling cards being treated like it was a prank by someone who knew what Kamoshida was doing. Hmm. Makes sense. Hmm. We're the ones who did it, and I still don't completely believe it myself. <laughs> Let's wait for things to settle down for the time being. Anyways, let's check how much this metal can be sold for. We really shouldn't sell it. It'd be better if we pawned it off ASAP. Ooh, got a hit! Wait, 30,000 yen? That's all a gold medal's worth? I mean, were you really expecting it to be more than 30,000? I mean, it's a, an Olympic medal, Ryuji. Remember that time in middle school? I lent you some money. <laughs> she wants him to pay her back after so long. Uh, There's no way I borrowed 30,000 yen from you. Well, maybe not 30,000, but... Yeah, it's obviously that you have not paid her back since then, so you're past due there, Ryuji. <laughs> Wouldn't it be around that much with compounded interest? Oh, ooh, on. <laughs> oh. She's, uh, sounds like she's hustling up a little bit here. Interest my ass. I'm not saying that I'm taking all of it. I mean, it's your fault for not paying me back all these years. It's just common sense. And she still remembers <laughs> that she had lent him money and never paid her back. So, like, I can't believe that. She's been waiting that long for him to pay him back. Ah, damn it. <laughs> <laughs> I agree on laying low and keeping an eye on the situation. However, you dragged me into this. It would be nonsense not to celebrate a successful mission. Oh, wait. Uh, uh, we 
dragged you into this? I'm pretty sure that it was more of a mutual agreement to all do this together and that no one really dragged anyone else into doing all this. I mean, we're the ones, I mean, Ryuji and myself are the ones who found Morgana in uh, that cell that she was in in Kamashita's castle. So, really, don't, doesn't she kind of owe us in a way for getting her out of there? I guess we could blow this dirty money on something fun. Discussions among phantom thieves are to take place over luxurious food. How about it? I'm always down for really good food. Hey, wait! Nah, I guess it's fine. There's somewhere I want to go then. Oh? Where do you want to go? Where's that? It's a place Shiho and I have been wanting to go for a while. Someplace new, maybe? I owe money, so I can't complain. <laughs> you good with that? Yeah, I'm good. Bye bye me, I want ramen. <laughs> uh, or we should save the money. Um, I mean, we should save the money. It's like save it for like a rainy day. Um, but if they're like, ready to just do whatever with the money, you know, like they have money to burn. And that's fine by me, but bad that. I don't know why I keep getting that done. Um, it, if they feel like they have money to burn, that's fine by me too. I'm sometimes the same way. Uh, yeah, fine by me. I'll leave it to your discretion as well, Lady On. I'll call and check the prices later then. Okay. When should we go? Want to do it soon, like tomorrow? Tomorrow? That, that's fine with me. Why don't we go on the last day of the holidays? Last day of the holidays. What day would that be exactly? I mean, it's the beginning of uh, May. It'll help energize us when school life starts up again the day after. Oh, are they talking about after summer break? Then, uh, the 5th on Children's Day. Oh, the 5th of this month? So, who's going to sell this? Leave that to us. We know a store that'll buy anything, don't we? Really? I mean, I've been taking this game kind of slowly. Uh, so it's like I don't remember everything that I've gone through. It's like <laughs> I would actually have to look at my past videos. And and really, I still believe that we shouldn't sell it. We should like keep it as a memento. Okay, I'll leave that to you guys. Ah, you're back. Is that gold medal real? When did it get inside his palace? When did it get inside his palace? I assume it's always been there. I mean, it, it was 
his Olympic medal. No, that one is a fake. It's just a byproduct of his cognition. That makes more sense, actually. The real metal should still be in his possession. Okay. Uh, this one's a fake, or Kamashita has the real one. Um. Either one of these are solid options. Uh. Kamashita has the real one. What? You're telling me Kamashita's still got the medal? Who cares? What matters is that we changed his heart. That's the important thing. And anyway, if we had taken the real thing, that'd be stealing. Well, even though that the Olympic medal that we took is fake, we still stole something from him. Even if, even if it is fake, it doesn't matter. I don't think he'll be proud of the medal anymore, regardless. Probably. Don't really know. If you let go of stuff pretty easy, huh? Wanna forget about my debt? <laughs> uh, not a chance, right? That's different. 500 yen is a lot of money for a middle schooler, you know. 500 yen. I, I assume that is a lot of money for a middle schooler. Do you, do you still... Do you even still have that dolphin anyway? Dolphin? <laughs> dolphin? <laughs> Uh, or what are you talking about? Uh, dolphin? <laughs> Stop digging that up! <laughs> it's like, I, I want to know what this is about, exactly. What is this dolphin that you speak of on? Back in middle school, we went on a field trip to the aquarium. Oh. An aquarium field trip? Oh, that, that's actually, that's actually really cool. But Ryuji had to spend all his money on a souvenir, so I lent him some. So I lent him some for the train fare. Uh, okay. I said I was sorry. I was for my mom. The souvenir was for your mom, not yourself, really. Well, I guess you can call it even after all we've been through. Thank you. Anyways, we don't gotta worry about selling that metal off, off if it's a fake. Yeah, since it's not real. Well, actually, since it's a fake, how how does it have like any physical? Uh, representation in the real world here. Shouldn't it just, like, disappear at some point? End of story. Kamashita will never be proud of that once-in-a-lifetime gold medal ever again. Are you absolutely sure about that, Morgana? I mean, an Olympic medal is... In a, is an accomplishment that is uh, hard to come by for anyone who goes into the Olympics. Depending on how you look at it, that punishment might be even worse than death for him. Hmm. Starting tomorrow, you'll have a lot of time off, huh? Must be nice. 
For me, it just means more customers and even more work. Is that really so bad, Sojito? Yo. Another box came for you. Oh, I got my uh, stuff from the Home Shopping Network, yeah. Hey! What did you get? All right, got my rations. Oh! Must be what you, must be what you ordered off the TV. Yep. Okay, uh... Celebrate your success and sell the medal. Take a look at our new, uh... Well, oh, those have... S Haven't I looked at these ones before? Yeah, th those are ones that I uh, bought from Tai Takami. I just hadn't looked at them, you know, so they don't say new. Uh, let's see. It's the... Where are they? Oh, right here. <laughs> Budigo restores 30% of HP to an ally, lowers attack, raises accuracy and evasion. Huh, okay. So it's a yin and yang. Lowers attack, but raises accuracy and evasion. It restores 50 HP and cures hunger for one ally. Okay. Uh, 10, ooh. It restores 10% of SP. I'm actually glad that I got this then. Lowers defense though. Okay, so a little bit of a yin and yang with that, too. Uh... That, okay, that's all my new stuff. Oh, and, uh, my new equipment, uh, the, the armor. Okay, Duke's coat. Plus 38 HP. Ups my defense quite a bit. I'll take that, yeah. Oh, I already have a Duke's Code on Ryuji. Uh, let's see, and... Old Cat Collar. Was that magic? Magic plus one? I assume that's what uh, Ma is short for magic. Oh, yes. She could use the de defense. And then on Angel Cape. Angel's Cape. A Theta Magic. Medium. Okay. Yeah, there we go. Probably could have used that defense uh, during the Kamashita boss battle. Read, study. Oh, I can do the crossword puzzle. Let's do that. Hey, hey. Yeah, play a little. Oh, and this is a new one. Okay. Hanamani, Cherry, question mark, Ewing. Hmm. And it's down. Oh, no, wait. That, that's a cross. Never mind. Flower to B. Flower to B. Hmm. Okay. Cross. This has sprung. This has sprung. A spring? <laughs> Prepared meal outdoors. That's a picnic. 
Picnic. This is sprung. Yeah, it's spring. Let's see. Why are the B? Fourth, fourth letter is an S. Cherry blossom. Wouldn't it be blossom? Would this be blossom here then? Then this one, cross flower to be. Uh, bud. Blossom. I've got it. The answer is blossom. Known as flower watching in English. Tanami is an old Japanese tradition for viewing the cherry blossoms and enjoying the arrival of spring. The flower- uh, it's like I was not aware that's what blossom- uh, what hanamani means. The flower mentioned in traditional Japanese poetry actually refers to the plum flower. It's said that cherry blossoms overtook the usage during the Heian period. All right. I see. Oh wow, even I couldn't figure that one out. Nice. Maybe you got a bit smarter after solving these crossword puzzles. All right, point up. Knowledge. Knowledge is power. <laughs> Okay, I I'm glad that doesn't pass time, actually. I was and I was actually able to finish that one. Man. Yeah. Like, I was able to fill that one out completely. Uh, let's see. What should I do? Study, read. I, I do have one more book that I can read. Can't hang out with Soji though. So yeah, I'll go ahead and read. So do you want to spend some time reading? Yeah, I still have Bujiko's story to read. That is filled with kindness, so this should up my uh, kindness. Make sure you close up. All right. Good night, Soji <laughs> Have a good night. And so, Buchiko kept waiting. Hmm. Buchiko, the story about this dog makes me cry every time. It's like a cat hey, crying hey. over a, a, a... A cat crying about a dog. Let's think about that for a second, shall we? Hmm? Oh. I didn't realize how long you've been reading. So, how far did you get? Seems like you still have some pages left. You should continue some other time. I need to get more books. Like, the, the uh, bookstore still doesn't have any uh, new books. Okay. So, I, I do wonder when the bookstore will have new books. Uh, there is... Uh, the Shujin Academy Library, though. I could check there. Hey, come on, we're going to pawn that metal today. Hey, you can hear me, right? Uh, yes I can. You don't have plans, do you? Come help me out, instead of sleeping your life away. I, I'm not sleeping, Sojiro. I am... Awake. We do owe it to him. Do we? <laughs> okay. We'll just have to wait. Hurry down and help him out. <laughs> Sorry, I kind of pressured you into doing this. Uh, oh, you're fine, Sojiro. And now to our next topic, Fall from Grace, the story of a dishonored Olympic medalist. Of course, this would be on the news. 
Just recently, a high school coach confessed at an assembly that he had been repeatedly abusing students. Given his prior Olympic achievements, this has caused quite a stir. I bet it has. Not just at school. What caused this habitual offender to suddenly confess these heinous crimes to his entire school? Uh... Well... There's... It's like, if you want me to explain it to you, newscaster, I can, but would you believe me? <laughs> the police are hoping that the upcoming interrogations will bring light to this question. Probably not. May... Uh, I can only assume probably not anyway. Isn't this... My friends would come back from practice with bruises all the time. Isn't that Yuta's voice? It was scary. But I'm relieved that the abuse is finally going to end now. Or is that a different student? I mean, we can't see his face. He would touch me and stuff all the time. Okay, th these are just random uh, students at the school. Never mind. And you never. Okay. So this female student here. You never once thought to like notify the authorities or you know talk to the principal about it. I'm glad I don't have to deal with that sexual harassment anymore. There were always rumors, sure. Not many people believed them, though. Like, I'm totally shocked they were actually true. At least now I can go to school without worrying. Yeah. I knew it. This is your school, isn't it? And yes, it is. Seems like it don't really... <laughs> Why would I answer with I don't really care? That seems like it. Huh. Things might be getting turbulent at school, but you need to just keep your head down, all right? I know, Seojito. More importantly, keep those hands moving. I've got some more stuff I need you to do. Okay. Man. The chief worked as... Uh, the chief really worked as hard. Did you see? It was on the news. No way the school's gonna be able to play dumb after that. Yeah. I saw it too. Chiho's name didn't come up, right? No, it didn't. Not that I saw. I bet they wanted to keep that part quiet. Probably. I'm so glad. It's finally over then. All we gotta do is stuff our faces and put this Kamashita crap behind us. I'm totally looking forward to this celebration party. I'll try not i will try not to let you guys down. Yes! Alright, we need to sell Alright, we need to go sell the gold medal tomorrow. Even if the chief wants your help, make sure you turn him down, okay? Uh... Turning him down may not be a good idea, Morgana. After, okay. all, after all, he's my... Uh, guardian. Basically, like, my parent. We gotta take care of business tomorrow. Like we told Lady On we would. Make sure you sell that metal. Okay. 
I can't I just like stash it in my room somewhere here? Somewhere that Sojiro won't find it. Is there a place in here like that? Morgana? Nice. You have to spend the whole day helping out. Make sure you find a way out of it tomorrow, okay? Okay. Well, <sighs> you know, we got a big story advancement here. So I, I want to say that this is a good place to actually stop for the day. Yeah, not a ton happened, but a very important story development happened. And I, I feel like I don't want to continue further on with the story too far and you know I'd, and just have like this part of the story be its own separate video because this is important uh, this was important stuff here and I don't want to diminish that uh, effect so yeah so anyway thank you all for watching and if you enjoyed the video and want to see more like favorite and subscribe to become part of the pack and don't forget to claw that bell icon so you know when a new video comes out and as always i hope you all have a wonderful day or night wherever you may be